January 14, Delay Watch therefore, for you do not know what hour your Lord is coming. Matthew chapter 24, verse 42, New King James Version I was anticipating this trip with great joy. Dad would be 103 in a few days, and this was phenomenal. Many family members and friends were coming from far and near to this birthday Thanksgiving party. Aside from the party atmosphere, we anticipated the worship and praise time we would spend together singing the old song of Zion in four-part harmony. At the airport, my anticipation was mixed with disappointment when we were told that our flight would be delayed for two hours. Then, the delay extended to an uncertain time frame which eventually became five hours. We just had to listen for the announcement and follow the lead of the airline employees at the departure desk. They themselves were uncertain. No one ever said why the delay happened, but I finally decided to put away my disappointment and occupy my time with reading. I also continued to work on an article I had started to write. I shared a few words of greetings and encouragement with some of the other waiting passengers, but many preferred to play their video games, listen to their music through their headphones, or pace back and forth. Suddenly, there was a great commotion at the counter which was next to me. A passenger lost her patience and her faith in the airline. This she expressed to the attendant in a very loud voice with abrasive language. Many others began to speak undertones of displeasure, their faces looking haggard and tired. But there was another scene. Some children were laughing loudly as they tossed a stuffed toy back and forth. They retrieve it and toss it again over and over as if they had no care in the world. They must have been tired too, but they were happy while waiting. I reflected on another scene. The bridegroom was delayed in Matthew chapter 25 verse 5 New King James Version. We are waiting for a very important wedding. We are uncertain of the day or hour, yet are we ready for His sudden appearing? Are we happy and joyful as we share with others His love? Or are we gripping about the cares of this life while we slumber spiritually? Please, Father, Help us not to lose our focus. We want to be ready when you arrive. Amen. Sonia Kennedy Brown